Hello everyone, today our topic is how to send telegram messages from Microsoft Excel. So here my objective is that whenever I add a new message in my Microsoft Excel workbook, then I want to use this message and I want to send this message on telegram. So for this, I will build a connection between Microsoft Excel and telegram. So for creating this connection, I'm going to use Pabli Connect, which is an amazing software for automation and integration. In Pabli Connect, I'm going to use trigger and action. In trigger application, I'm going to use Microsoft Excel. In action application, I'm going to use Telegram. So how I am going to build this connection for that, let me take you to my computer screen. I hope all you can see my computer screen. And today we are going to see that how we can automatically send messages on Telegram through Microsoft Excel. Suppose we are adding the data in our my Excel workbook. And in this workbook, I'm adding the messages that I want to send on my on Telegram. And I want to use this data to send as a message on Telegram. So we need to build a connection between Microsoft Excel and Telegram in such a way that whenever I add a new data or a new message in a new row in our worksheet, then we want to use this data to automatically send as a new message on Telegram. So for that, I will open a new tab and search for pabli.com. And this will take us to this landing page of Pabli. Here we have two options, sign in and sign up for free. If you don't have any account with Pabli, you can just sign up for free and it will take only two minutes of your time and you will get hundreds of tasks free every month. Or if you already have an account, you can just sign in and you will get to see this page. So these are all the apps that Pabli offers and we are going to use Pabli Connect here. For that, I'm going to click here on Access Now button under Pabli Connect and this will take us to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here, this is the workflow section and we can see all the workflows that we will create here. And this is the folder section. We can create new folder here and we can save any workflow in any particular folder that we want. Now I want to create a new workflow. For that, I'm going to click here on create workflow button and this window will pop up. Now I have to name my workflow. So I'm going to name it as my objective, which is to send telegram messages from Microsoft Excel. Now I'm going to select the folder where I want to save my workflow. So I'm going to open this tab and I'm going to select home here and I will click on create. And this will take us to this most important window of our workflow. Here we have two boxes, trigger and action. So these are the two main principles on which our workflow works on. And trigger says when this happens, action says do this. So trigger is going to be the first step that will get executed in our workflow and action will just follow that. So we need to set up our trigger first. And here my trigger application will be Microsoft Excel. So I'm going to select Microsoft Excel here. And now I have to give a trigger event. So I'm going to open this tab and new row in worksheet will be my trigger event. So I'm going to select this. And now I will connect Microsoft Excel with Pabli Connect. So I'll click here on connect. I will click on add new connection and I will connect with Microsoft Excel. So here I have already logged into my Microsoft Excel account in my browser. So it has detected that. So now I'm going to click on accept to give access to my account. And my connection here is successful. Now I have to select my workbook and for this, let's go to Microsoft Excel. And here, this is my Microsoft Excel. And in this, I'm using this workbook, which is named as Telegram Messages. And we are using sheet one. And I have these two columns. So first one is of date, second one is of message. So this date column is for reference only. And the date is of 18th of January, 2024. And the message is, this message is for testing. Now I will go back to Public Connect and I'm going to map all these details. So here I have to select my workbook. So I'm going to open this tab and in this tab, you will find all the workbooks that are connected with your Microsoft Excel account. So here I'm going to use Telegram messages workbook. So I'm going to select this and we only have one sheet, which is sheet one. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on save and send test request button. And here we have received this new response. And if you don't get this response instantly, then don't worry. This is a polling based response and it is going to take about eight hours to send the data. And in every eight hours, Microsoft Excel will send you the new data that is adding in your selected workbook. And if you want to decrease this polling time, then what you need to do is you need to contact to the Pabli Connect support team. Now I have received this new response and in this, I have this message which says this message is for testing. Now what I need to do is that I want to use this and I want to send this as a new message in Telegram. So for that, I'm going to add this action step. And here my action application will be Telegram. So I'm going to select this Telegram bot and now I have to give an action event. So I'm going to open this tab and send a text message or reply will be my action event. Now we'll connect Telegram bot with Pabli Connect. So I'll click here on connect. 
Now we'll click on add new connection and to connect telegram bot what I need to do is I need to give a token and how I'm going to get this token for that I have to go to telegram and in this I'm going to use this bot father. So you have first search for bot father and here I'm going to click here on this menu and I'm going to create a new bot so I'll click here on new bot. Now I have to name my bot so my name will be Excel to telegram and I'm going to send this. Now I have to give a username to my bot and while giving the username one thing I need to keep in mind is that my username should always end with underscore bot. Excel to telegram underscore bot so this will be my username so I'm going to send this and here we can see it has generated this token for me so I'm going to copy this token and I'm going to open my bot so I'll click here and I'm going to start my bot. Now we'll go back to public connect and I'm going to paste my token here and I will click on save. And I have successfully connected telegram bot with Pabli Connect. Now what I need to do is I need to get a chat ID and for getting the chat ID what I need to do is I need to go back to telegram web first and I have to create a new group. So I'll click here on this pencil icon and I will click on new group and here I have to add all the people that I want to add in my group and also I have to add my bot here. So I'm going to search for my bot. Here I have added my bot now I'm going to click here on this icon and I have to name my group. So I'm going to name it as new messages. So this will be my group name new messages and I'm going to click on this icon again. And here I have created this new group which is named as new messages. Now I'm going to open this group and here I have these two members in my group. Now for sending the messages what I need to do is I need to give a admin permission to my bot. And for that I have to use my mobile phone and in my mobile phone I have to open my telegram application and in telegram application I have to open my group and in the group profile I have to promote my bot as an admin. So I'm going to do that and we are using telegram web here so telegram web doesn't support to promote anyone as an admin. So I'm going to use my mobile phone to do that. Now I'm going to refresh this and here I'm going to open my group profile again. And here we can see that I have promoted my bot as an admin. Now I need the chat ID and for the chat ID I have this path URL and here after this dash this is my chat ID. So I'm going to copy this number and I will go back to public connect and I'm going to paste my chat ID here. Now I have to give a text message that I want to send. So I'm going to use the data that I have in Microsoft Excel workbook and I'm going to send that data as a message on my telegram group. So for that I'm going to map that message here and I'm going to use mapping. So what mapping is mapping is a technique through which I can retrieve the data from the previous tabs and the data that is changing will get replaced with the new data in the real time. So for mapping I'm going to click here. I will open this response of Microsoft Excel and this is my message that I want to send. So I'm going to map this. So I have mapped all the required details that I want and if you want to fill other details you can do that too. Now what I need to do is I need to click here on save and send as request button and here I have this new response. So this is a positive response and this means that I have sent a message on my telegram group and I have used the data that I had in my Microsoft Excel workbook. Now to check this let's go to telegram and here in my group I can see that I have sent this new message. So the message is this message is for testing and I have sent this message on my telegram group automatically. So this is the same message that I have as a data in my Microsoft Excel workbook and I have used that data and I have sent it that message and I have sent it that data as a new message in my telegram group. So here my connection between Microsoft Excel and telegram is working successfully and whenever I'm adding a new data in my Microsoft Excel workbook then I'm using this data and I'm sending that data as a new message in telegram. Now let's go back to public connect. And here we have created this connection between Microsoft Excel and Telegram in such a way that whenever we are adding a new data or a new message in our Microsoft Excel workbook then we are using that data and we are sending that data as a new message in Telegram. So let's summarize what we did here. So first I have set up my trigger and my trigger application was Microsoft Excel and my trigger event was new row in worksheet. Then I have set up my action and my action application was Telegram bot and my action event was send a text message or reply. So this is how I have successfully created this workflow and you can also create this workflow by following all the steps that I did in my workflow and I'm also going to put the link of my workflow in the description so you can check it out from there and thank you for watching this video. Not just these applications, you can automate and integrate a lot more applications like this using Pabli Connect. 
If you need any help or if you have any doubt, you can email us at support at theripabli.com. If you have any queries, you can post them at forum.pabli.com or if you have any issue with the pricing of Pabli, you can connect on this link. And if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.